Many of you have probably noticed more butterflies around Central Texas recently. So joining me today to talk about that is Dan Hardy with the Austin Butterfly Forum. Talk to me a little bit about the role uh, Austin and Central Texas plays in the monarch migration. Yeah, we're right in the central flyway of monarchs. In this monarch generation that we're going to see in the next few weeks, it'll be, oh, maybe this week, maybe the second week of October, going into the end of October, beginning of November. Those are monarchs that are moving down through central Texas. They became adults or emerged as adults, maybe in southern Canada. And those are steadily moving their way down as adults through Nebraska, Kansas, Oklahoma, and they'll reach Texas for this coming month on their way to their roosting sites in Mexico. And then do they come back then in the spring? Yes, those uh, ones that are going out to Mexico, they'll, they'll overwinter. Then at the, at the end of the winter, they'll mate. Uh, the females will start moving north, laying eggs. We might be the first group they get or the second group that, that gets to us. But eventually that, that first group of the females will die and then the next generation picks up. It's kind of like handing the baton to somebody in a relay, relay race. So we will see monarchs back here in uh, March and April. Is there anything we can do um, in our yards or in our, in our, you know, in our backyards that would help butterflies? There's two things that can attract butterflies to your yard. One is, you know, uh, nectar for pollen, you know, for food. But the bigger thing people don't think about is food uh, plants for the caterpillars to eat. Because all the caterpillars of these different butterflies have very particular diets. They're very finicky eaters. Hmm. So if, if they don't see the right food, they die off. And for example, uh, monarchs need milkweeds, snouts need hackberries, uh, gulf fritillaries need passion vines. So if you plant those things in your yard, uh, you'll attract the butterflies that will lay eggs and you'll have a new generation appear in your yard.